Hey, what's up guys, it's Banu here from AndroidAll.com. This is the new Galaxy S23 and this is last year's Galaxy S22. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to transfer data from the S22 to the S23. So Android to Android transfer, I've already done a video of the initial setup process of the S23 as well as another video on the Galaxy S23 transfer uh, from an iPhone to the S23 as well. So you can go ahead and watch those videos on my channel as well. So if you are interested in Android to Android transfer, this is the video for you. So without wasting any more time, let's get right into it. So here I have the Galaxy S22 on my right and the S23 on my left. So what, I, what we are going to do is we are going to be using this USB Type-C to Type-C cable that I have over here for this transfer process. So it's going to be easy for us uh, to do this wired because it, it won't take much time when we do it this way. But you can also do it wirelessly if you wish. But I strongly recommend the wired process. So get a Type-C to Type-C cable ready in order to uh, start this process and make sure that both of the devices are charged to a certain extent so uh, that you have that battery to get started. So uh, first thing we are going to go ahead and select the language so I'm going to go ahead and select English United States, agree to all the terms and conditions and here we get the option to transfer from Galaxy or Android device. So here on the other device that is our old device we have to go ahead and scan this QR code so I'm going to go ahead and open up the camera and just go ahead and go to this particular link just like that now it says verify that it's you so i'm going to go ahead and place my fingerprint and now it is connecting to the wi-fi network and it says continue set setup on your new device if you watch my iphone to s23 video you you saw that uh, when we proceeded with this it asked us to connect uh, type c to lightning cable to the S23 and the iPhone so that the transfer could be done wired. So let's see if we get a pop up here asking us to connect uh, these two Galaxy devices so we can do that. So now we get the option to add an eSIM to the device. I'm going to go ahead and select skip for now. I will add the SIM later. Now we get the option to transfer the apps and data. So here we are going to do it with smart switch. So here automatically on my old device, it asks me to install smart switch. So I'm going to go ahead and enable it and update smart switch and install it here on my new device as well. I can do that here. It's showing me the option to do it wirelessly or I can use a wire. I'm actually going to go with the wired uh, route because it's going to be much faster for me. So I'm connecting this type C to type C cable to both of these devices. So now both of these devices are connected so right now i'm gonna go ahead and select smart switch and use a cable instead allow this and allow it on the old device so now i have to go ahead and select uh, whether i want to send data or receive data on the old device i want to send data here so i'm selecting that and now it says connecting to transfer your data here uh, and we are having this pop-up also over here so i'm going to go ahead and select that and press ok and now on the s22 it says that it has been connected to the galaxy s23 it recognizes the device and it's connected through this wire like i said so both devices are connected through this type c to type c cable so that's pretty convenient and uh, here the transfer is happening it's searching for the data to transfer so i'm going to transfer the data from this to this wired so i can transfer everything on this phone onto this phone because it's a galaxy to galaxy transfer it will uh, works uh, seamlessly i can get all the pictures videos everything on this phone to this one without much interaction so this is pretty awesome now it's asking us whether we want to transfer everything on the device or just calls, contacts, messages or custom. I actually want to transfer everything on this S22 to the S23. So I'm going to go ahead and select everything and hit on next. And it asks me how many messages I want to transfer. I'm going to go ahead and select all. So yeah, so I can even transfer and backup your Viber data. I'm going to do that as well. 
So here on the old device, you will get an option to keep the screen on. So I would strongly recommend you guys to enable that option so that the phone won't go into idle, idle state. It will continuously make the data transfer. Now, while the transfer is going on over here on our devices, here we can go ahead and continue with the setup. So you can go ahead and add fingerprints, passwords and all of that. I'm not going to do that right now. I'm just going to skip that right now. Here, now we can go ahead and uh, agree to the Google Assistant terms and conditions. And if there are a couple of applications that Samsung is uh, you know, suggesting to install, I'm going to go ahead and install them as well. I'm going to actually go through all the apps that I have installed on this new phone later on and get rid of the ones that I actually don't want because there are a couple of apps uh, that are there on this old phone that I want to get rid of as well. So I'm going to go through that once it's done. So just like that, now we are done with the setup process on the S23 over here. Now the data is silently transferring in the background. As you can see, the home screen that we had here has already been moved in and all the apps are now installing on the S23. And once that is done, I can start using uh, this phone instead of the S22. I just have to take the SIM on this and put it in, or I can just use the eSIM and get that done as well. So that's pretty nice. But guys, that is how you transfer from your old Galaxy S22 to the S23, or you can use this to transfer from any Android phone to the new Galaxy S23. I hope you guys found this video useful. If you did, definitely go ahead and smash that subscribe button right now. Hit on that like button because that keeps me motivated to make more awesome tech videos just like this. Go ahead and watch my other Galaxy S23 videos and let me know if there's any particular video you would like to see featuring the S23 lineup. With all of that being said, guys, until I see you guys in my next video, this is Banu signing out.